What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's good to see you tonight on the Speaker City Show. Like, subscribe, and click that notification button so when I get information out, you can get information in. Hold on we a second. Are... Hold on a second, speak. <laughs> hey, what? wait, 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 wait. Hold on a second, speak. I got one for you. Yeah, Dude, I'm no, right in the middle of something. let me do this. What? No, it, this one. What this one's it? about togetherness and unity and and coming together as one. He's always uh, interrupting. To, to, to help celebrate oh, the five ahead. million views that we just got. We did. Over we did. Thirty thousand subscribers. Yeah, yeah. Pretty good, huh? Go Can ahead. I? Go ahead. Oh, oh thank you. you. You won't regret this. Okay. Speak. You're gonna let this one. You're gonna love it. You're gonna love it. Ready? Yeah. Here do we it. go. One, two. We are the world. We are the world. We are the children. Yeah, we are the children. We are the ones who make a brighter day. So let's start giving. Ooh. Where you're down and out, and they're seeing the hope at all. But if you just believe, there's no way we can fall. There's a choice we're making. We're saving our own lives. It's true, we make a better day. Just you and me. Yeah. What? We are the world. No, okay, we stop, 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 stop. What? Stop. I'm d no, we're not doing it. What? I'm not approving we that. We worked all week on that. I worked all week on that. No, it's not happening. It, it's a, a great song. Dude, you don't care? You no, don't I do. care about us? I do. But that was horrible. Okay, well, <laughs> your show, man. Yeah, it is. <laughs> For now. What? I want my 10K. Sorry about that, guys. That was a uh, that was that was a trippy. <laughs> I, I'm freaked out by the pig right now. That was the worst performance. I love the song. He just he ruined it. He just ruined it for me. The the greatest artist in the world, the greatest musicians in the world sang that song, and I just had it ruined by a fake pig, by a pig. Oh man. Well. Anyway, guys, we are at 5 million views. I want to come up here and I want to thank you all for getting us to this point right now. Over 33,000 subscribers today. And I just got a, a, a thing in the... Uh, I'll, put, I'll pin the picture up there. 5 million views because of you guys like that. We are doing this because people are getting grants. People are getting paid. People are getting money. They're getting the, the wisdom and the knowledge into where to, in the places to go and how to get there to get money from the, from the government and uh, money that taxes get put into so that you can get paid and we're seeing the uh the fruit come from it now and it's just an amazing thing i want to thank you all for watching i want to ask you to like and subscribe and i just wanted to give this video out to you all right now to say thank you all so much for supporting this family that we've we have got here today and uh i'm going to go over a, a quick grant that's going to happen in massachusetts and money given out, out in a couple more uh states right now and i'm just gonna first of all say thank you all very much i love you all and uh Thanks for uh, joining this big family. Like and subscribe and somebody say, hey, we still want our 10K. We are the world. Yeah. All right, guys and girls, like and subscribe. Once again, I'm sorry about all that time the pig took up with you. So let's just dive into these grants that are available right for, for you right now. And we're going to start with Alabama. Alabama Innovation Corporation is currently accepting applications for its Innovative Alabama Supplemental Grant Program. The grant program is open to Alabama-based businesses that received Federal Small Business Innovation, SBIR, and Small Business Technology Transfer, STTR, grants. Those businesses can apply for up to $250,000 in additional funding to further support their innovative project. Eligible businesses are encouraged to apply by August 1st. Now, if nobody's ever jumped into the SBBR or STTR program, I suggest you do that. Take a look at the SBA, go to SBIR, and then go to STTR, and you might want to get a grant proposal for that. So you can go online, get a grant proposal for that, and, and check out those grants. Because if you get in that system, you're very likely going to get a grant in the future. So once again, check that out. And this one is specifically for Alabama. Okay, next we're going to go into West Hartford, Connecticut. West Hartford, Connecticut has a new $2 million grant program to support businesses that are still struggling from the pandemic. Eligible businesses and nonprofits can apply for up to $10,000 to qualify. Organizations must have 50 or fewer full-time employees and submit an application by August 10th. There's the link that you can see down below if you were to type that all in. However, I'll put a link below in the description as well. Now let's head over to New York. Only in New York, 
recently unveiled two grant programs to support the city's small businesses. The first program provides funding for marketing activities, and the second provides rental assistance for businesses struggling to make payments. Eligible businesses can apply for $5,000 each under the program, with a total of $100,000 allocated for each one. There are multiple rolling deadlines throughout the summer. The next window closes on August 12th. So you would go to the Small Business Development Center at Jamestown Community College. That's where they're going to be serving these contracts. That's where you're, you're going to be uh, get, lending this money from, from the Jamestown Community College. is serving the contracted free consultant for applicants and as a clearinghouse for applications. So if you go to there, if you go there on their website or whether you can drive Jamestown and go there in person, even better, um, you can check out that grant if you need it for your business and for your rent and all that fun stuff. So next, we're going to head over to the Massachusetts. They just got a lot of money, guys. Massachusetts just got $52.7 billion in funding as the Massachusetts economic recovery continues. The budget supports a baker Polito administration's focus on promoting equitable growth and opportunity for communities and businesses across Commonwealth. The budget provides $32.2 million for the Small Business Technical Assistance Grant Program, which supports diverse entrepreneurs and small businesses, along with $20 million for the Community Empowerment and Reinvestment Grant Program, $17.2 million for local economic development projects, and $10.7 million to support Massachusetts tourism and hospitality. Now, I'm going to be going over that grant more as we get it in because that money was just put out as far as the American Rescue Plan Act goes, and we're seeing a lot of the uh, idle grant money going there, and we're seeing a lot of $10,000 grants as well in those areas that they're going in. I'm going to keep you informed as soon as they come out with where that money is going to be sent out from. I will be here to let you know and I also, hold on one second, guys. Don't go nowhere. I don't have the, the, the notes on this yet, but I want to also say Indiana was just approved for $99.1 million in two different programs, including a venture program capital that's allocated over $70 million. Maine was just approved for $62.2 million. So a lot of that's going to be going to small businesses. Uh, New Hampshire was just approved for $61.5 million. Uh, Pennsylvania has approved for $267.8 million. And all these are going to be having small business programs. Remember that. And I will let you know as soon as we find out where these funds are going to be distributed from. South Carolina is approved for $101.3 million. It will operate in a loan participation loan. So loans is good, too, if you need loans. Uh, they're usually low interest, so it will operate a loan participation program to which it is allocated $50 million and a venture, venture capital program, which it is allocated $51 million. South Dakota was approved for $60 million, and it'll operate a loan participation program. They'll have grants and stuff there as well. And Vermont was just approved for $57.9 million, and it will operate three different programs, including two venture capital programs and... and to which uh, it has already been allocated $29 million. So we're going to find out where those are going to be distributed from. And I will let you all know that as well. Go Bucks! What Can you see that? Go Bucks! Go Bucks! Hey, Jason McElhome. Jason, what's up, dude? I need Jason McElhome. I, I want to put a bet on him that my Bucks are going to beat his Cowboys in the first game. Okay. Let me get that down there. There. Now, I'm, I'm, I got that out of the way. I hopefully will be able to continue this throughout the week and find out where these grants are going to be coming from and where they're going to the money is going to be distributed to there. You can go talk to somebody and say, Hey, I, I could use some of that. So hopefully this helps guys. I want to thank you all for watching. Let me know where you're located down below. So our staff can look over these comments and see if they can help you in your area. Remember, we will never try to come after you and ask you for personal information. Don't watch the spam spam and Instagram and all that hacker down below in the comments. They're out like gnats right now. Those, those, uh, the, the scammers out there. So don't let don't let anybody in the comments pull you in to say we can help you get this fund. It's it's not an SBA agent. It's not a a, a legit person. If they're in the comments scrolling through YouTube looking to find some uh, people to to take advantage of. So be careful of that. But guys, I want to once again thank you all for subscribing and liking and growing this community up in a very big way. Love you all, and we're going to continue trying to help everybody out there in this time of need and uh, in. Can somebody say, hey, love you all? And we still want our 10K. Yeah, we do.